today is abs, 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 abs. Got two new exercises in this one. A little bit weird. First time I've ever done it. So let's hope it looks good because it might look like some exercises do and look a little bit awkward. But that's good. We like awkward because what awkward means that we're just trying new things. And if you don't try new things, you never know. Face <laughs> here. So, are you ready? We've got four exercises. You're gonna do three rounds if you can, but I don't mind if you're just adding this onto the end of your workout and you're just gonna do one round or you're gonna do so many of each. You pick how you wanna do your ab workout. How I'm gonna do it, I've set my timer. 12 rounds, 50 seconds on, 10 seconds rest, and I'm gonna push as hard as I can and I'm even adding a little bit of weight in this as well to make it a little bit harder. Now, because it's a balanced routine, you may need to take the weight out to start and then you might want to add it into the next round, but have something handy to push yourself if you're finding that you've got a bit more in you. Okay, you ready? What is this for again? Abs, abs, abs! Oh. <gasps> Drop your timers. Ready? 10 seconds. So, we're in the plank position to start. Yes, we are. I've got some weight involved. It's going above my head. I've got three seconds on the clock. Are you ready? Two, one, let's go. So your elbow is going to your knee. Then you reach over your head. So, I want a straight body line. If you need to put your foot on the floor, then do so. If you need to take the weight away, then do so. If you can't actually even move your leg and this is as good as you can do or even no moving at all, that's fine. Stay with this. If you're finding that your wrists are hurting, you're gonna go down onto your elbows and do this, okay? So they're your options. 10 seconds. Three, two, last one. Ooh, a little bit premature, you should always wait for the beat. Okay, plank position. So you come up, hold. Up, hold. Up, hold. Straight body line, stay low. Keep your bum low, keep your head in line with the spine. Pull your abs in. When you twist, breathe. Pull your abs in. Twist, breathe. Stay low. Keep going. 30 seconds in. I know your abs are burning. No mine are already. Come on, push. 13 seconds. It's all about the plank. You have to pull it in, in the middle. side, get your weight, let's go, so straight body line, get that first, ready, over the head, let's go, over the head, so we're working everything here, obliques, abs, plank, arms, legs, balance, all over, abs, yeah, balance, sing to yourself, if you need to distract yourself, that's fine. You can do that. Expect 20 seconds, push. You got this, all the way over, reach all the way over. I want you to really go for it. Up death, uh-oh, don't wobble. Don't wobble, please, concentrate. Looking at my time, I made me wobble. I need to concentrate. Keep pushing. Well done, awesome job. Last one, new move. Starting a squat. Your hand points to the back of the room. You go back. Hold it for a second, change sides. Hand to the back of the room. Grab it out, all the way back as far as you can. Hold it, come back, change sides. Hold it. Really go high onto your toes, hold. Hold for a second, change sides. Turn around, up, 
hold, reach over as far as you can, hold, come back, let's go, over you go, now, if you're not super, super flexible, you're going to find this difficult, just like me, but that's why we do it, because we push ourselves, and we try new things, but it will uh, uh, make you sweat, like me, push, hand behind, up you go, lift onto your toes, crab, really crab it out, over, change sides, I'm going to tell you something really gross. Apart from my abs that are absolutely killing me right now, I'm so sweaty that I'm sweating from behind my knees. So when I was bending down, it was squelching behind my knees. Squelching. How gross is that? That's really gross. And I thought I would share that with you. So that's it. I want you to do that three times through. That last one, if you need an alternative, you're going to go to the crab. So you're going to do this one. So you're going to hold your crab and you're going to touch your toes. That's your alternative for this, okay? If, if you can't touch your toes, you can always do a pelvis lift. So you're going to go down and then lift up, down and then lift up. The other three, I showed you the alternatives when you were doing it. So keep your feet on the floor if you need to. You can take the weight away if you need to. You can go down onto your elbow if you need to. But I want you to try and move. Move your body in ways that you didn't do before. That's why we added that last one in. Because it's difficult and it makes you move in a way that you wouldn't normally do. Get a mirror. I want you to see you coming up onto your toes. It's the first time I've done it. So I'm going to try it on my own and I'm going to try and get better at it. And we're going to add it again and we're going to be awesome at it. And that's how it works. That's how you get better. So give it a go. Tell me what you thought. Three rounds. And I'll see you on the next workout.